The film starts showing a prison. Its system is very mysterious and its building comprises almost 100 floors. Then the kitchen of this prison is also viewed. Where many chefs are making a variety of tasty foods. It was the good point of this prison. Let's tell you how good this is. Now the prisoner used to live on each floor according to their punishment. And the food used to serve them on a platform. The serving of that food used to start from the top floor and it gradually moved down. The prisoners on each floor had only two minutes to eat that food. Let's talk about the two prisoners who are the major characters of this movie. And they are imprisoned in cell number 48. Their names are Trimagasi and Gorang. Platform of food has been set. And it had reached their floor 48 while descending. Trimagasi says to Gorang, eat as much as you can feed yourself. When Gorang glimpses that platform of the food, he feels awkward because the food has been spread on it. Because the prisoners on the upper floor had attacked the food. So Gorang only takes an apple from it while Trimagasi takes a lot of food. As the platform of food descends then their cell temperature begins to increase. In fact, Trimagasi had preserved some food from the platform while eating. Which was against the law and orders. And their cell was heated in order to punish them. Now this temperature may not be moderated until they return the food or die. It is seen that Gorang is totally unique from the other prisoners. Because he is not any criminal but an educated person. He himself came to the prison to get rid from the addiction of smoking. Otherwise, he had also brought a book along with him. He had to get the certificate in return. Next day, it again happens as such that the platform moves to their floor, Trimagasi fills his stomach soundly. But Gorang does not get up from his place. Because he was not habitual to eating the left food. Trimagasi asks him, what is the issue with you? Why do you not take food? Just ask from the ground floor prisoners. What do they face when they don't get food? I have also spent a month as it is and my condition has turned to the worst. Goring also disliked it that the upper floor prisoners don't leave food for the bottom floor prisoners. So he attempts to contact the upper floor prisoners. Kindly eat less and also care about the bottom floor prisoners. But the upper floor prisoners were very rude and they overlooked his request. And the bottom floor prisoners used to be dead because of not attaining the food. Then they come to know that a prisoner has committed suicide. Then Trimagasi informs Gurgan that it is routine wise happening here. Trimagasi tells that my cellmate died. When I did not get the food then I quenched my appetite, eating him. The time of the food delivery is approached as they are talking. And that platform begins to move upward. But a girl is also seated there. Gurgan asks her, what happened? Do you need any help? Trimagasi advises Gurgan, leave her. It is her routine. She acts the same in each month. Actually, her child has died. And she peeps on each floor to search for him. And she also does not allow anyone to live in her cell. Because it was her aspiration to have her kid. When that platform is descending with a seated girl, then the prisoners of cell 49 begin to tease her. And that girl named Miharu kills those two prisoners. And she again sits back on the platform. In the same way, time continues to pass. A month has passed since Goran came to this prison. Trimagasi and Goran had befriended each other closely. Sometimes it used to happen that the platform moved upward speedily. So the upper floor prisoners quenched their appetite, and the bottom floor prisoners left hungry the time it descended. So it happened that the platform started to move from the bottom to the upper floor. And there was no food left until it reached the upper floor. So the upper floor prisoners either died with starvation or commit suicide. One day, Trimagasi and Gurgan were sleeping. Then they come to know that the drug has spread everywhere to knock them out. And it occurs when there is a requirement to change their cell. Now they start to wish, their cell may be selected in the middle of the building floor. Because the prisoners in the cell amid the building were at an advantage. They could get a little food either the food platform descends or ascends. Sometimes the bottom floor prisoners were at risk and sometimes the upper floor prisoners. They notice, waking up, that they are on the building floor number 141. And Goreng finds himself tied. Trimagasi says, moving towards him. These are days when the food platform ascends. The food platform will have been emptied when it reaches there because we are in the cell of 141. You are thinking, why have I tied you? So listen. I may eat you with the passage of days, feeling the appetite Trimagasi is appearing very wild here. Three days have passed here. Trimagasi is feeling appetite here. It is obvious that Gorang is also feeling hungry. But everyone's power of tolerance is different from others, including how good-hearted he is. Gurgan never thought that he may quench his appetite while cutting off Trimagasi. While Trimagasi had already thought about it. Now he begins to cut the flesh of Gorang as he feels the appetite Gorang shouts. Then Miharo appears there, seated on the platform. 
and she rescues Gorang. Being freed, he kills Trimagasi. Miharo starts to eat the flesh of Trimagasi, coming there. She also asks Gorang to eat it. Now they eat this flesh for many days. Because they had to spend the whole month in some way. Even though Trimagasi's dead body had worsened. The insects had bred in his flesh. But Gurgan begins to eat his flesh a little bit to survive. At last, this month has also passed. Then it is seen that Gurgan knows after waking up that he is on the building level 33. At this time, his cellmate is a lady and she also has a dog with her. And this lady herself had come into this prison as Gorang had arrived. So she may learn to eat while sharing, getting the experience of the circumstances of this prison. Actually, this lady is the part of management, who had interviewed Gorang before his entry into the prison. Then it is seen that the food is delivered and Gorang takes food, filling his stomach. But that lady serves her dog a little food. And she eats nothing, so the prisoners on the bottom floor may take food easily. When the platform of food descends to the bottom floor then, the men of that floor are the worst. They eat food voraciously. That lady asks them, what is the problem with you? Why do you not leave food for the bottom floor prisoner? But they don't act upon her said words. One day, Goreng says to them, I will make all food filthy if you don't leave the food. So you will also not be able to eat this food. So the prisoners on the bottom floor agree with them. In this way, the food begins to leave behind a little bit. As a result, the prisoners of the bottom floors had started to survive, eating it. Then it is seen that the same girl Miharu arrives on that platform. She kills the dog of that lady. Consequently, a dispute started between both ladies. Now that lady whose dig has been killed, she says to Gorang, Miharu is insane. She has no child and her mental balance has been disordered, coming here. Don't be entrapped by her. Now Gorang asks his cellmate lady, why have you come here? Then she tells me, I am suffering from cancer disease. It cannot be cured. And I will soon die. In the same way, this month has also passed. Gorang's cell number was required to change, this building has not only 100 or 200 floors. It is known that this prisoner has many building floors which cannot be counted. Now they are on the 202 building floor. Gorang notices that his cellmate lady has hanged herself. Here Gorang begins to suffer the hallucination, it means, he visualizes that his cellmate tells him, coming there, that I commit suicide so you may survive, eating my flesh, but Gorang was not willing to eat her because she was a very decent woman. Moreover, she was also suffering from cancer. Gorang is very appetizing. Because the food was not being delivered to the building cell 202. He began to eat the pages of his book reluctantly. But he moves to the dead body of that lady when his appetite is not quenched. And he starts to eat her. Similarly, this month has also passed. Now he awakens on the building floor 6. His cellmate is a man at this time and he has a rope. He tells Gorang, I will move to the top upper floor. And I will escape, using this rope. But its implication is not too easy. Everyone begins to tease him instead of helping. But Gorang saves him and says to him, Stop. We will move together on the platform for a few days. We ourselves will deliver the food to all little by little. So the food may be left for everyone. And they begin to carry it out. When they are moving on a day. It is seen on the building floor, that some prisoners are trying to kill that girl Mihiru. Goreng immediately kills those prisoners, reaching there. And he rescues Mihiru. Meanwhile, Goreng is also very injured. Mihiru had already been injured after being beaten. So she dies here. Now that insane girl Mihiru was also no more. They again ride on the platform. Now the platform descends beyond their thought. Just think where the last floor is. There they observe that a girl is hidden under a bed. This little girl is not anyone else but the daughter of Mihiru. There is still left the little food to them. A very little. Because Gorang's cellmate has preserved it for him. Gorang serves that food to that little girl then he descends. It is seen, coming downward. That Gorang's cellmate has died. They had also been wounded when they were rescuing Mihiru afterwards. Many wounds had bled a lot. Then it is seen that Gorang has also made that little girl sit on that platform. Now that platform is descended to the bottom now. But Trimagasi glimpses him as he moves downward. Who says to Gorang, you have passed your trial. Actually it was the hallucination of Gorang to see Trimagasi. This platform will ascend back and this little girl will remain here. People mostly lose their courage. Look at this little girl. How cute she is. You descended due to this little girl. But we were unaware about it. But it was unknown that Gorang may survive in the basement or not, because this building was very complicated. No one knew the exit. The ending of this movie is unseen.
It is rather told that little girl again descends. The movie completes this scene. I hope that you will like the explanation. Thanks for watching. Do you like this type video then subscribe my channel suspense recapped.